Hey everyone, in today's tutorial we're going to build a light leak in Photoshop. Here's the photo we're going to be working with. So we're going to give it that vintage look with just a bit of a light leak. I'm going to try to go for something along the side here like a band going up and down. So let's get to it. The first thing you want to go to is Layer. and You want to go to New Fill Layer, Gradient, and you hit OK and you're going to get this white band across here. So to get this band going up and down, I'm going to make it vertical. So that angle is now vertical, so it's hazing from left to right. So you'll see when I go along to the gradient here, I double click in here. And now this controls the, the points in here. So the first thing, let's start from the left at the bottom. Go to this color. I'm just going to make it black. Hit OK. Going to go to this one to the right. Same thing, make it black. Hit OK. And then over here at the top, I'm going to click this and I'm going to, I'm just clicking it so it selects black, makes it easier for us. And I'm working with the right side of the page. So I'm going to go click and drop a couple pins here. Don't worry about this. So now that I have these three here, I'm going to click this one. And now on the opacity, make that zero. There you go. And you can see the band starting to form. So let's bring the band a little bit tighter. So let's move these pins over just a bit because I'm going to make it to the right of the bike. And I'm going to click this pin and this little guy here. You want to click and drag and you're going to see that it brings it in a little bit tighter. So I can do the same thing here, bring it in a little bit tighter. Okay, so I'm happy with that. Let's hit OK and OK again. And you can see we've got a nice black band there. So that's the first step. Now with this layer here, you want to go to the blend mode and switch that to screen. And it disappears. Perfect. Okay, we want that to happen. All right, now the next thing we got to do is go to the gradient fill again. So go up to layer, fill layer, go to gradient, and we're going to hit OK. It's the same thing again. And we've got that white band mist going across the bottom. So let's click the gradient again. Now this time we're going to start from the left and we're going to switch the color to something a little bit more red. This is where we're mixing in the color of the light leak. So let's start with sort of a, a reddy orange one. So I'm going to go with sort of a red here, hit OK. And then you go to this pin and we're going to make it a little bit more yellow. So I'm going to go right about here and select something right about here. OK. And I'm happy with that color hit OK. Now this is where I, I'm changing the angle because wherever that black band was, this is where that red will show up. So I'm going to angle it a little bit like this so it's going to be appearing more from the top. And a, a little bit on the bottom here too. So I'm going to go right about here. You can see it's angling down this way. So you hit OK. And there you go. So now we got to mix these together so it only shows up where that black band was on our first gradient layer. Now how you do that is you want to hit Alt or Option on a Mac and then hover right between the two layers. And you can see this little arrow and box pointing down. Right when you're there, now holding down Alt and Option, you can click and there you go. It sort of links it down and it's attaching this gradient layer to there. So that's it. As you can see, now we have this cool light leak band going across our page. So I'm just going to group these together. And there's before and there's after. So that was it. That's how to build a light leak in Photoshop. <music>